Hello, young folks. Uh, this is uh, Mr. Tolbert, and I just wanted to give you a quick refresher about unit conversions. I'm going to go ahead and do this quick video for you here just to show you how to get get this particular little piece done because we're going to be doing some conversions. Um, and I'll be asking you to do that with several problems. And here's how you do that. Uh, here it says write on your word map or own paper. Basically, folks, what I'm asking you to do is just to take some notes and, and pay attention to how exactly you do convert. So in this particular example here, it says, uh, um, first step is to write the given units. I'm going to try to convert from 20 um, meters per second to kilometers per hour. We're going to write out each step, then we're going to reverse it. Um, on the TIE Fighter, the TIE Fighter is, of course, that little fraction set, set up that I have here. So let's go ahead and go on. There's a couple of other things that we need to note is uh, there are some units that you'll need to know, like, for instance, the term kilo means 1,000. So there are 1,000 meter in a kilometer. Um, there are 60 seconds in one minute, and there are 60 minutes in one hour. And so some of these are just simple conversions that you already know. All right. So here we're going to uh, convert 20 meters per second to kilometers per hour. So we'll have to convert the meters to kilometers, and we'll have to convert the seconds to hours. So how many minutes, um, how many meters in a, a kilometer and seconds to the hour? That is exactly what we're going to be doing in this problem. So let's go ahead and write out the things that we know. I have 20 meters per second, and then I set up my little TIE fighter. And uh, remember, the original unit um, is on the top. The new unit goes on the bottom. It looks like I'm solving here. That way, this meters can cancel out that meters there. Boom, click, click, leaving you with the unit that I'm looking for. And that is my new number. Then I'm going to keep on going. I'm going to keep on going because now I have this information that's 0 0.02 kilometers per second. But I'm not finished. Remember, in this problem, I'm moving from meters per second to kilometers per hour. So far, all I've done is kilometers per second not kilometers per hour. So I'll have to continue this quest. So I'm going to take that given information and write it down in a brand new TIE Fighter, being it was the given information, kilometers per second, set it up so that I can cross cancel the um, kilometers per second here. Um, I'm going to set it up so I can cross cancel and finally get rid of the seconds. So that one is going to be reversed. So here in this particular situation, um, here that is, thank you so much. Let's go ahead and continue this. Um, if you notice now, I have set the seconds across from seconds so that they can be canceled out. And then that will give me the unit that I'm looking for. So if, if you're following along here, on this very top problem, I say 20 times 1 is 20. 20 divided by 1,000 gives me this number here. Uh, once I have this properly set up, the TIE Fighter, 0 0.02 times 6 and 0 0.02 divided by 1 gives me 1.2 kilometers per minute. But I'm not quite done. I'm going to go ahead and take that information and move it on down to my next possibility down here at the bottom. Still trying to cancel out so that I can solve for the time that I'm looking for. The time that I'm looking for is hours. I'm looking for moving from meters per second to kilometers per hour. So I'm continuing to do this until I can get hour in the right spot. Uh, in this situation, I set up that TIE Fighter so the minutes cancels the minutes. I would take 1.2 times 60 and divided that by 1. And then that would finally give me the thing that I'm looking for. Back up one. Sorry. All right, so that'll finally give me the finished product that I'm looking for. I converted in my very first step my kilometers, and finally I had to switch it up because I needed to get the denominator to be canceled out. So I kept going until I got hours on the bottom. So that is how you do that in a nutshell. Uh, watch this as many times as you need. I hope that you're doing well, and have a great rest of your day.